Okay guys, so this is my PC, and something I want to do is vertically mount the GPU. So this is the GPU, also known as the graphics card. And what I want to do is take it and rotate it 90 degrees like this, so that that bottom part is facing outwards. So I think it looks a lot nicer and a lot cooler. The problem is my case doesn't allow it. Some cases do have the ability to do it, but mine doesn't. I'm still mad at myself for not buying the higher end case. But anyway, so this is the part. Uh, it's multiple pieces. I'm not sure how long it's going to take to print, but we'll pop it in Akira, slice it, and see what it says. So here's our parts. So I'll try to lay these all out nice and neatly. Okay, so this is everything. And I want it to be nice and sturdy, but I don't think I have to do too much of an infill because the stuff that uh, <clears throat> stuff that really matters is pretty thin. So it's already gonna fill it in pretty solid. I'll go ahead and make it like 30. And I think that'll be good. Slice. Oh, you know what? Hold on. I think I have tree support. Actually, does this need support? Ah, uh, yes it does. A little bit. Okay. Support. And... Tree support. Don't want that. 10 hours, 31 minutes. So, it should be done at about 10.30 then. Assuming I started it right now. <clears throat> so, I'm guessing it'll probably be done at about 11. So, I guess we'll, uh... I'll go get the SD card and export it, and we'll start printing. Okay, SD card in. Let's go ahead and name it. Okay. And save. Eject. Grab the card, and let's go print. Didn't really think through the timing on this. I also didn't expect it to be a 10 hour print, so this is probably gonna be going up Wednesday. But uh, we'll see. Okay, so it looks like the, uh, I don't know if something's off. Oh, you know what it is? Uh, well, that shouldn't matter because it should just get its positioning. Anyway, that's really odd. See, my thought was that maybe, like, the belt has skipped in the past, and I thought maybe that messed it up and it thinks it's somewhere where it isn't. But that couldn't be the case, because every time it starts to print, it resets using these little switches here to tell it where it is. So, I'm not too sure what to do here. Turn off the GoPro. Okay, I just re-sliced it. This time I did less raft, and I moved everything towards the back a little bit. Okay, I think I'm just going to start it over quick. Okay, so this is where we're at. I think I'm going to start it over because I uh, re-sliced it. I figured out the problem. Uh, I was using the preset that Kira had for this printer, which had the wrong bed size, actually, which is kind of interesting. 
But uh, anyway, I fixed that and I re-sliced it with 20% infill because that's what uh, the guy that made this said to use, so use that. And uh, I think we'll be good now, so I'm just gonna end the print and start the next one. I'm not gonna bother showing that because it's just gonna be really repetitive. Okay, I thought I had it fixed, but after some testing I found that it's definitely not fixed, so I'm just talking to some people on Reddit trying to figure out the problem, so hopefully I'll get that figured out. 